welcome to Vlogmas 2019 with me, Talia from Talia's Nail Tales. That's right, you guys, every single day in December, you're gonna have a video from me leading up until Christmas. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to do a super easy, super blingy set of snowflake nails. Now you can take bits and pieces of this particular nail design and apply it to other sort of designs that your clients are requesting this time of year, or you can take it away as something really easy to do on your clients that come in either not knowing what they want or don't have very much time for their appointment. So let's get started with this design. The first thing that I'm gonna do is just go in with some Fusion Clear Base and we're just gonna put this all over her nails which is gonna act as a barrier for the glitter gels that we're gonna go in with. The first glitter gel that I'm gonna use is Light Elegance's Tiny Diamond which is a great white glitter gel and I'm just gonna put this on the free edge of her pinky nail here and then I'm gonna take my brush with whatever is left on it and fade it down the nail. Then I'm gonna go in with some of this Icicle Loose Glitter from the Glitter Boutique and I'm just gonna drop it in that wet uncured gel. This is my favorite way to do a glitter fade and glitter fades are the easiest design to do I find on my clients if you're limited in time but they still want something really fun and sparkly and then if you throw some chunky glitters in with it it just looks really great as well I'm going to do the exact same thing on her pointer nail by taking some of that tiny diamond as well and fading it down into the nail and dropping some of that loose glitter on top of it I am also going to do the exact same thing on her thumbnail too so I have three nails that have the glitter fade design on them but it's a super easy blingy way to do a glitter fade On her ring finger and her middle finger, I'm gonna take some of this Silver Sparkle Glitter Gel from Light Elegance and I'm gonna put this as a base all over the nail. And then I'm gonna go in with some of Light Elegance's Expensive and just dab some of those glitters on top of the Silver Sparkle. Originally, I had tried to use this Expensive Glitter Gel uh, on its own and I didn't like that it wasn't super concentrated, so putting it over top of the Silver Sparkle just gives a really nice dimension to the nails and it makes it really sparkly as well. Whenever I do a glitter fade, I like to take a color that blends from the glitter gel into the natural nail, and this expensive color worked really well for that because it wasn't so concentrated, plus it matched the other silver nails that we had created in this design. I'm going to embed all of these glitter gels with my Fusion SL Clear. I'm going to stamp these nails with these three stamping plates from Clear Jelly Stamper. These are my favorite snowflake plates whenever I want snowflakes on my nail designs. Because the pinky nail, pointer nail, and thumbnail have a lot going on with it with the glitter fade, I just decided to do snowflakes on the two middle nails. When I do snowflake stamping, I just like to make it kind of random, but I love to kind of put the snowflakes kind of off-centered a little bit and tie it in with some smaller ones as well. I do like to put Swarovski crystals in the center of my snowflakes for the clients that like it. So in this particular nail design, I decided to use these blue ones here because I thought that they would match some of the other colors that we had going on. And this nail design is complete. It's super, super simple, but to add a little bit more pop, I'm gonna use this glitter top gloss from Magic Gel. I love these for this particular time of year when you want lots of bling on your nails, and this is a nice way to add a little bit more bling to the nails is with your top gloss. This is a great nail design to do for those clients that want some really blingy nails for this time of year and you maybe just don't have enough time in your schedule to do something super crazy or your client needs to be out the door super quick. You could easily just do a glitter fade and stamp some snowflakes on top of it or you could do full glitter nails like these two middle ones, snap some snowflakes on top of it or you could just do the glitter fade on its own and they'd be good to go. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys come back tomorrow for another Christmas series video with Sarah and I. Come back two days from now and I'll continue this Vlogmas series. Thank you guys so much for support on all of the videos already and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!